Hello, Reading community. We hope that you had a great week. Starting right with some shout outs. Uh, first shout out goes to the RMHS boys hockey team. So the RMHS boys hockey team have advanced the final four of the MIAA state hockey tournament. Uh, we'll take on Zavarian Brothers High School this weekend on Sunday uh, at 5.30 p.m. at Songus Arena in Lowell. So huge congratulations to the team. Wish you the best of luck this weekend in the final four. Second shout out goes to all those involved in getting unified basketball off the ground and running at RMHS. So on April 4th, um, RMHS will launch the first unified basketball team, which will promote inclusivity and positive connections amongst peers. Uh, student athletes will participate in five games, uh, Middlesex League games during the season, and then conclude the season with a jamboree at Wakefield High School. In the written newsletter this week, there is an article about unified uh, basketball here um, written by Olivia Johnson and Olivia Rotondo, who are both RMHS seniors. So a huge shout out to all those involved in getting that up and running here in our community. Next shout out goes out to RMHS senior Abigail Lobovich. Uh, we're thrilled to share that Abigail has moved forward in the national merit competition, is now a finalist. Uh, she is one of only 8,000 students nationwide out of the well over 1 million students who took the PSATs to qualify. Uh, congratulations on this tremendous accomplishment, Abigail. Uh, next shout out goes to all the uh, students and staff involved in the uh, exchange program uh, or the study abroad in Spain. So from February 18th to March 4th, 15 RMHS students traveled to Spain uh, with Senora Prey and Senor Ryan. Uh, while there, students stayed with host families, spoke a ton of Spanish, attended classes with their counterparts who came to Reading last September. Uh, ate a ton of different food and visited the city uh, cities across the country. So uh, you see here some photos from the trip. Thank you to uh, the staff who helped lead and facilitate this trip and also for this, all those students involved. Diving so now, shifting gears, some shout outs to some updates. We have one update from Killam uh, MSBA. So we are really excited to share that the MSBA has voted to invite Reading to partner with the MSBA in conducting a feasibility study for Killam. Uh, this next step invites the town to partner with MSBA to explore uh, fiscally responsible and educationally appropriate solutions to the problems we've identified at the Killam site. So uh, this feasibility study pursuant with the regulations, uh, MSBA's regulations and policies requires our town to work with the MSBA uh, on the procurement of an owner's uh, project manager and designer, which will help us in the feasi bring the feasibility study to fruition. So really excited about moving the process forward this next step, and we'll keep the community informed as we continue to uh, move the work forward. Next update is a Friends of Reading Metco event. Uh, so the, friend, the board of the Friends of Reading Metco would like to invite our community to a family social on Sunday, March 26th in Boston. You see here the flyer for more details. The event is free. Oh, donation, donations are always welcome. And there's a link in the written newsletter to both sign up or donate. Uh, we hope to see our community to join us. And last but not least, kicking off communication around Arts Fest 2023, uh, the district-wide district celebration of the arts is just one month away. We know there's excitement in the air. We also know this is one of the uh, uh, annual events that's a favorite for our community. Uh, this is scheduled for Monday, April 10th, Tuesday, April 11th, and Wednesday, April 12th. Uh, we, as you know, there's going to be a ton of events around uh, visual arts on display, musical performances. So you see in the written newsletter a link to a flyer with more information and a schedule of events. So we look forward to that coming in the next month. As always, we hope that you have a wonderful weekend. Go Rockets!